previously on Super Neptunia RPG. Neptune and friends learn more about Vert's interests. Suddenly, strange monsters called Pokemon, not to be confused with Pokemon, attack our heroes. A familiar face shows our heroes the method of entering the sunken city of Planetune. What will be the fate of Neptune and friends in this underwater city? Find out in this episode of Super Neptunia RPG. Welcome back to some more Super Neptunia RPG. Last time we did a few things that... We met IF, more specifically. That's what one of the few things was. And, oh my gosh, it's a monster. Okay, they're protecting the mermaid statue. Awesome. But yeah, we have to go find this mermaid statue in order to get the Planetoon... In order to get to the underwater place of Planetoon. Hopefully we can do pretty well. This guy is- I just fell. Awesome. Good job, me. Washa! I did- I was trying to attack him. But I guess I didn't quite get that. Zat. Uh, what are you weak to, good sir? You are weak to fire. Okay, well, that's pretty- Oh, wait! Speaking of fire. Bam! Yeah, that's right. Burn. Burn. Haha, -ha, he's ice. I- Perfect. Perfect. Just attack with Neptune and Noir every single time, and he should die within like three seconds. Yeah, look at that. Already almost dead. Bam, bam, bam. Shimmy, lam, wham. It just was literally him waiting for him to actually just die. All right, Noir is leveled up. Nice, nice. Cutscene time. Oh wait, blue shells. The last- oh, <clears throat> <clears throat> let me prepare my blonde voice, which is not a voice at all. The last scale has to be around here somewhere. Hmm, maybe it's like underwater. It must be this. Hmm? It won't come off. No, Vert. No, 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 Vert. Totally off the marks. Besides, those are she- those are- they- those are seashells, not scales. But then- Hmm. Let's see. Hey, maybe it's that thing over there. What thing? Goodness, where? There, in the, there, in the middle of. I don't know why I did a combination of the two. There, in the middle of the two radishes behind the statue. So, statue soldiers, sol shoulders. Uh, the middle of the two white radishes behind the sol shoulders. Wow, I cannot talk, can I? Um. I can't talk really. Under the blue shell, past the mackerel, above the small shell, around the flounder. Shell, mackerel, then shell, flounder? Oh, good grief, I cannot keep up. Isn't it that, the glittery scale on the mermaid's tail fin? That has to be it. It stands out too much. Yeah, that's what I wanted to say. Please, Neptune. Why didn't Neptune just go and pick it up? Bam. Let me see, Noir. Wow, it's so pretty. How sparkly. Be careful with that. Whoa. What did I just say? Oh, we have like little bubble heads. Huh? Underwater respiration material. All right, we got a legendary item. Man, and I thought it was just a rumor. A rumor? Either way, we must proceed to the underwater city. Hopefully. If it does what the girl has said it could do. Well, it'll work out in the end, but be careful. We might be able to meet mermaids in the underwater city. Who said anything about the mermaids? Ugh. <laughs> Shall we go then? You can now double jump? What did that have to do with, like, anything? Head to the Planetune Sea! Alright, let us head to the Planetune Sea. How do we get to the Planetune Sea? That's the harbor. Like the wind. And then, I guess we just, like, head how we normally did? No, doggoo. Bad doggoo. You cannot touch me! Oh, this double jump thing is pretty neat. Oh, that's... Look at that. Look at all that double jumping. That's nice. Oh, frick. I just found an enemy. Awesome. Um, yeah. Right, you guys are the ones that are weak to the sun. Praise the sun. 
But hey, that was that's interesting. Yeah, and then it resists everything else, but then again, it doesn't have that much health. Yeah, we met these guys in the last episode. They were not they were not fun. I will give it that. Like they just take a while to kill. They're not hard. Although they do deal a chunk of damage. He's dead. He's not dead. What is the heck? Hey doggoo, stay very back. Back, 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 back up, nerd. Uh, we'll just need... Right, I forgot how the setup works. And then... There, now we should be all good. And now we wait. So while we wait for this battle to finish up... Let's talk about something for a second. If you haven't noticed yet by the time this video goes up... Uh, Neptunia Rebirth 1, as well as Valkyria Chronicle videos have not been popping up like they should normally, based on the release schedule. That would be because, as of right now, I want to do ne Super Neptunia every single day. And doing that in conjunction with, like, the other videos that I do normally, like Sunday videos, that's, that's not hard. That's just fun for me to do with editing. Nip. The Rebirth 1 and the Valkyria Chronicles, having that as well, doing that at the same time, it's just too much stuff to do at once. I don't have time to actually just do that in general. So for now, I'm putting them on pause. On pause, let me emphasize that. They are not going away. They will still be around once I finish this Super Neptunia. Then I will continue playing them, and then of course we'll go with normal schedule. But after those two are done, I will be going back to only one video a day. I save. Or one playthrough. That's my, not my bad. We're going to go back to one video a day. Because two videos a day was just too much for me to handle. I just could not do it. It was just too much exporting, too much uploading too much editing for me to just handle and I'm sorry for that but hey at least we're putting more quality into these videos here and once it's done we'll go back to the normal quality that we used to see with Neptunia Rebirth 1 and wow this thing is really weak goodbye oh okay yeah hit me once bam you're dead wow that was a lot easier the rats were harder all right, let's go. Underwater time. Whoa. It's beautiful. And the water is so clear. It's like we're in a dream. If the item's effect wore off, we'd all... Never mind. Forget I said that. They say that... Say when little kids wet the bed, they dream about being underwater, right? You guys. All right, where do we go? Whoa, there are monsters under here. I'm kind of... Curious. Double jumping is gonna make things a lot easier. Like, look at that. Double jump. Oh yeah. Uh, let's see. Where do we need to go? We need to go. Wow, we have to go through a lot, don't we? Okay. Just keep heading right. Keep heading right. That's all we need to do, right? And then just avoid the doggies or the mobs. I really. They're not all doggoos. I don't know why I keep calling them doggoos. I guess because they're just like the doggoo sprites. I mean, that's pretty dumb. I almost encountered that. Okay, what if happens if we just like fall? No, nope, nothing happens. All right, let's save the game. We're supposed to explore the Planetune Sea. I'm curious. So this is Planetune, right? It sunk underwater. What happened? during that, that caused that the, to just sink. It couldn't have been the, oh hi, more spirit armors, what the frick, man. It, it couldn't have been Neptune, right? Like, we all know this. I'm like, it's Neptune, Neptune wouldn't do that, right? Probably. Not on purpose, at least. It kind of feels like Uzume. If you think back to Mega Dimension, Mega Dimension. If you think of Neptunia V2, you think of Uzume and how she kind of destroyed everything by accident. 
Maybe it could be like that? Although I'm not quite sure about that. It would be quite interesting and kind of weird for a side game like this to even introduce the idea of something dark like that. That was that was like a whole different take for Neptunia in general other than the Conquest ending. Oh, frick. So... Ooh. Also weak to fire damage. Okay. Are you resistant to lightning? No, you're not. Okay, so just Neptune... Ver... Oh. Are you not weak to? Oh, you're weak to Earth. See, I don't have Earth attacks. But it is weak to lightning. Nice. Well, that was fast. Bam. Okay. But yeah. I must level up further. I doubt this series, this game would be dark enough to explore that idea. Like a kangaroo. Oh, okay. Uh, how do we get there? Hmm. It says it's past that. So we need to just find the entrance, and there it is. Now we need to head right. I don't know why it's being like this. Oh wow, that's a big map. Okay, whoa, you can zoom in on these? That's cool, actually. Oh, and cutscene. I can see something. It must be the underwater city. It really is intact. It's so pristine. Amazing. Oh! Neptune? No, it's nothing. My heart just kind of felt funny. Look at this city. It's your city, that's why. I wonder what it's all about. Oh well. No use wondering about it. Let's go. Continue forward. I almost ran into the dog because of that. Uh, I would have been very upset. More cutscenes. Oh? There's something stuck in here. Well, it is a, it's a sunken city. There's a lot of things. You're right. What is that? What is it? There's like a lot of games. There's 3D game software that was in the magazine. Four goddesses online? What? It's real? There's something like that over there. It seems like there's actually a lot around here. Artisan did ask us to gather intel. Let's collect as many as we can. You just want to play them, don't you? <laughs> no, that is absolutely wrong. I do not even wish to play. Well, whatever. Let's just collect them. Gotta catch them all. Am I right? Why is it doing this? It's like going way towards the edge that it needs to be, and I don't quite understand that. Gather game software. Curious. I, better I imagine we don't actually have to. We can just go to the to the next bit of area without any problem. Yeah, see, there we go. What's that? A submarine. Oh snap, it's Krabby Crab submarine thing. The Margot's Hall, it's Bombix Mori. What are they doing here? I believe they are collecting games too. Hmm? Oh wait. I don't know how to do a robot voice. Uh, huh? What are you doing? That's what we should be asking. Why are you collecting all these games? If they are left behind, they are wonderful 2D games we all have. The wonderful 2D games we all have now will fade away. Lady Kid, or er, Lady Fillin, she has ordered us to destroy all the relics from the past. Lady Fillin said if the games ever, if the people ever played 3D or VR games, it would corrupt them. But that is top secret, and now you know, we have to destroy you. Beep boop beep. We didn't ask you to tell us that. You. To speak of the destruction of such wonderful games, I will never forgive you. It's pissed. My wrath will no- well- my wrath will know no end. We will crush them and recover every game they have. That's your objective? I figured. Well, it doesn't matter now. Or... Or... Chia League... Wacha. Are we fighting a submarine? How does that work? And you're weak to lightning. Okay, we... W that's it. That's a shoe. And we win. GG. No re. Bam. Look at how much damage. Wow, this is just gonna be easy peasy Joe Schmo. Look at this guy. Look at this dude. Look at this dude. 
Wow, you think that's damage, nerd? Wow, this is- no, 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 this is damage. This is real damage. You wanna harpoon me, nerd? You wanna harpoon me? I got a men nut. Take that, loser. I got a men nut, can you say that much? Dang it, fall back, we have to report this to Lady Fillin. That's right, you get on, get, get. You leave those games behind. They were already keeping tabs on us, but now they definitely know we're a threat. Arg. I'm gonna nap them all up, Noir. You should noir them all up too. What does that even mean? It means you nap them up, or in your case, you noir them up. Ah, I will, of course. Vur up anyone who commits crimes against games. I would, uh, blah them? That sounds weird. Hey. Blah, blahing. Okay, you got napping, you got gnawing, you got verring, and you got blahing. Honestly, blahing seems the most normal out of all the four. I can't believe this, we're still talking. I can't believe we're still talking about this. Come on, let's go. Hair flip. Sass. Alright, let us go up to the surface. Whoa. Looks like we can breathe normally here. What is it? This smell, it's familiar. Sniff, 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 sniff. Snurk. What? You're like a dog. You're like a dog. I was almost doing the bird's voice. What did you say? <laughs> dot, dot, dot. Run away. Bye, nap. Hey, come back here. Well, uh, oh, okay. For a second, I thought we had to split the party. That would have been very funny. Whoa! Look at this place. It's kind of cool. It's like a little uh, underwater. Whoa! Underwater base. Look at that. Where do we even go? I I don't know. This is crazy. Which floor do I want to go to? Let's go to floor one. Looks like we're locked. Does that mean we have to lock every single floor? Oh, that's what. Okay. That's kind of an interesting mechanic. I, this is one of the most interesting dungeons, actually. Frankly. Uh, now, how do we unlock it? Um, hmm. How do we unlock this? Do we have to defeat the guys here? I imagine, maybe. Okay, let's try that. We'll do that and we'll come back. And it's just these guys again. Oh, these guys are such pushovers. Like, look at this. This is these guys. Such pushovers. Yeah, they yeah, are, yeah. Attack us, attack us, attack us. You're gonna die in like three seconds. Look at these guys. They're such pushovers. With their little icy powers. They think they can win. What nerds. Bam. I win. We got an access card. Okay, so we did have to actually do that. Now we got the access card. Go away. And then we head back to the elevator, and then we can go to floor two. And then we repeat this process every single floor. Okay, that's not bad level design. I mean, it's alright. It's not amazing. I mean, that's what I mean to say. But it's pretty darn good. I like it. It's enjoyable. It's kind of like just running in, guns blazing, it's kind of like a shoot 'em up thing, but also not at all in any way, shape, or form. I don't know why I make that comparison. But yeah, it's like an objective, actual thing you have to go through instead of just getting cutscenes. Like you, we had to do for their everything else, pretty much. You're weak to lightning, we'll wall them all up. Lightning. Yep. Lightning! lightning. That's right, heal me up, because Vert has th over 3,000 HP, I just noticed that. Jeez, Vert is so tanky. What is the deal with that? Wow. And like, Vert has only... So, I uh, only has not that much actual uh, HP, XP, HP. HP is one of the words I'm looking for. Whoa, it's good. The floor kind of moves a little bit. It feels like it moves at least. Ah. Oh, wait, that wasn't the key. Oh, we have to. F 
Oh, oh, ho, ho. There's three of them. That means we have to fight three of them in order to find the real one. Ooh. Fun. Wait, there's a... Oh, okay, those are just stairs. Wait, no, I want to go back. Now you die. Rawr. Oh, you're just the one. Wow, it's even more of a pushover. Dead. Super dead. Now, did we get our access card? We got our access card number numero dos. That is two for all the non-Spanish speakers here. What does a reflex do? See, I thought that was a weapon from Blon at first, but it's not. Apparently it's an item. Going up. Do 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 do. There's only one here. Wait a minute. Hmm. Suspicious. Do we just fight every single one here? I mean, we have an advantage against every single one. If they're... I don't know. They're... Yeah, if they're like these guys, Neptune and Virg will destroy them. That's not hard. Like, look at that. We get extra stuff against them. Bam. 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 Burn. Lightning. Burn. Lightning. Burn. Lightning until they're dead. And if the other ones are just weak to straight up lightning, then Vert, Noir, not Vert, Noir is just going to absolutely destroy them. Are you going to give me my key card? No, you're not. Excuse me, sir. Do you have any key cards? So, hey, will we actually get the key card? Who knows? Where was the key card? That's also a good question. Find out in the next episode of Super Neptunia. RPG. Never